In this video, I'll be showing all of the new leaks in Roblox Islands for the next update. Welcome back to another video. So we haven't had any leaks for the Halloween update, but now we have leaks for the next update. So I thought this was going to be like Halloween update part two or something, but it turns out it might not be. So right now we only know a small part of the update from these new leaks that came out that I'll be showing in this video. The first leak is the flower table, and so I guess this is the flower update. This could just be a small part of the update though, because usually in updates there's a main thing and then there are smaller things, so this could just be one of those smaller parts, and then there could be something even bigger in this update. But if this update happens before November 1st, which November 1st is the day the Halloween event is supposed to end. Like, next Friday is the 30th, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, next Friday is the 30th, so they could probably do an update then, and that would be two weeks since the last update. So the day before Halloween makes the most sense for an update to happen, so this is probably just like a smaller part of that update, and there will be more Halloween stuff. But if they don't do an update then, and the update is after the Halloween event ends, then that could possibly be the main part of the update. But again, let's look at the flower table. So, the flower table has some flowers on it, and uh, it's a table, and there are also some flower pots on it, so there are going to be a lot of things you can craft under this, probably. But I do also have some leaks of the things that are going to be involved with the flower table, so if we go back to my island real quick, I'll show you guys where the flower table will be. So if you just go over to the workbench, I don't know which tier it is, but if you just go over to it, the flower table is definitely going to be one of those things under here. And it could still be under here, but also be a game pass. My guess is it's probably going to be a game pass item, because it seems like they kind of like to do that. It could even be a complete remake of the floral bench. I'm thinking that actually they might make it so that the floral bench is called the flower table and then all of this stuff is under the floral bench and it's still going to be a game pass or maybe the floral bench will just be extra things and then the flower table will be the free version of it. Actually never mind, right now the confirmed name of the flower table is flower pot station now sometimes they change things whenever they're adding them into the game like how aquamarine was originally called prismarine and a few other things were called things but changed but right now the confirmed name for it is the flower pot station next up we have all of the flower pots and a new watering thing now, I don't know why there's a new watering thing, I guess it might just be like a decoration or something maybe, because we already do have a watering thing under the workbench called watering can, maybe it's gonna be like a better version of it, maybe industrial watering can, but then we also have all of the flower pots, so I'm guessing that you're going to be able to craft a flower pot from the flower table, and then you're going to be able to just like click it with a flower, kind of how you are all ready to click, or like the firefly things, you can click them with the firefly and then it will put the firefly inside of it, so that's probably going to be the same with the pots and the flowers. But there are a lot of different flower pots, and you're most likely just going to need wood to make them, and then you'll probably need some dirt too, because it would make sense, because you know how you have like dirt, and the flower pot's made out of wood and stuff, but if you want to just put a whole bunch of flower pots around your island and decorate your island with flowers, then this part of the update's for you. But now, for the part of the update that I'm pretty sure we're all going to be the most interested in. Now this is probably one of the biggest leaks, one of the biggest changes that will happen to islands if my predictions are correct. So this leak is, well, it's all of the flowers. So there are going to be so many new colors of flowers added, and I know you're wondering, well, how is that super huge? Well, 
if you think about it, you know how to craft different colors of blocks? You have to use flowers? Well, now you're probably going to be able to make very many different colors of blocks. Now, it's not confirmed yet. I'm not completely sure, but since you're getting new flowers and then you have to use flowers at the, col at the coloring station, then I'm pretty sure that they're going to make it so that there are new different colors of blocks. So imagine clay, but any color you want. There's blue, there's dark blue, light green, dark green, yellow, orange, red, white, pink, black, and there's also a sunflower. Now, I don't really know what the sunflower will do. I saw a picture of it about two months ago, and it looks exactly like that picture, so I don't know why it looks exactly like that picture and why I saw a leak of it two months ago, but I guess the sunflower is coming now. But now, the question is, how will you get these flowers? Well, they're probably just going to spawn on your island. The seeds of them haven't been leaked yet, and if there are no seeds for them, that wouldn't really make sense. But it's possible they could spawn on, like, the Buffalo Core Island and those other islands also, and then you can just collect them there, and then you can't get seeds for them. Or they could just spawn on your island and you can't get seeds for them either, but they're probably just going to spawn somewhere and you can collect them, most likely on your island, because there already are some flowers that spawn on the mob islands, and you can't really do that much with them. So these flowers, if you're going to be able to make blocks with them, that means they're probably going to spawn on your island randomly, like the yellow, red, and blue flowers already ready to do. By the way, whenever the update happens, I'm going to do videos on how to get stuff, and I'll try to stream it if I can, so make sure to subscribe with notifications on so you don't miss that. Also, like the video, if we hit 3,000 likes, then uh, I'll eat an avocado and islands. But those are all of the leaks so far. Usually, whenever new leaks come out, there are more soon. So I'm guessing that within the next few days, we're probably going to have a good amount of new leaks. And I'll do videos on those leaks. Also, the update's probably going to be on a Friday around 2 p.m. EST on October 30th. Because, well, that's just the time they normally update. It's been on Fridays for the past many updates, and also it is usually around 2 p.m. EST or originally planned for 2 p.m. EST. But there are some things that you need to use the blocks that you need to use the flowers to make. So there are going to be different colors of other things too, like if you go over to the carpentry bench, then the large red bed you need red carpet for, so they're probably gonna make a bed with all of the other different colors if you are able to make new colored blocks with all of the new flowers. But if they do that, then there are going to be so many things that are going to have different variations and new furniture and a lot of other stuff. There was one recent leak that wasn't added to the game, and it is that gold boss mob thing. Now, I'm pretty sure that they're going to add it at some point, maybe in this update, maybe the next update, maybe they were just working on all of the Halloween mobs and didn't have a chance to finish that, but I'm thinking they're probably going to add it at some point, possibly even after the Halloween event update thing ends on November 1st, because, well, it doesn't really look like a Halloween mob, so I mean it's probably just going to be a regular mob later. And then, also, in the thumbnail of Islands, there is a white mouse. Now, in the game, there's only that mouse that you always get whenever you eat candy or throw a potion. So right now, there's only that dark gray mouse, like, right here. There is no white mouse yet, so maybe they're going to add some sort of white mouse at some point it could possibly just be a variation of whenever you turn into a mouse or it could be something entirely different like a new mob or something like that it's also very likely that it's just a decoration for the game's icon thanks for watching let me know what you think will happen with these leaks and the upcoming update but also make sure to subscribe with notifications on for daily islands videos or mostly daily videos also like the video join the discord server and roblox group link in the description for training and talking about roblox islands and follow my twitter at telling i'm trying to hit 2500 followers there 
there, and 200k subscribers on YouTube. Also, linked in the description is a guide called Roblox Islands Guide, and it has basically everything you need to know about islands on it, so if you need help with anything, then check that out, because it's probably there. But I'll see you all in the next video. Bye, YouTube!